Next week, BBC Two's Great Depression movie is Sidney Pollock's powerful They Shoot Horses, Don't They? Jane Fonda and Michael Sarrazin in a Dance to the Death prize marathon. That's at quarter to 11 next Saturday. The blackest of conspiracies. From this very room, we shall become lords of creation. A reluctant hero. You let your friend down in combat, and you're dishonored. I can live with that. Two brain-fried hippies. Time's come to fight back. And what do you suggest we do? Sneer them into submission? We have advantages. We have decent numbers. We have surprise. We have a raving lunatic on our side. Everyone has weaknesses. In a fight for the very survival of the planet. This, if you like, is Genesis. BBC Two presents Ben Elton Stark, starting Wednesday, December the 8th. In 1986, Peter Jepson Young, a Canadian physician, was told he had AIDS. Unable to practice medicine because of the debilitating effects of his disease, he began a weekly segment on a television newscast in order to combat prejudice about AIDS and homosexuality. Over two years, viewers grew close to him and accepted him into their lives. He became affectionately known as Dr. Peter. The television diary of a remarkable man the broadcast tapes of Dr. Peter, tomorrow, 9.20 on BBC Two. And this is the rest of tomorrow evening on BBC Two. It's the second semi-final of One Man and His Dog at uh, ten past six. At seven, the money programme investigates why a British compensation scheme may have to pay out around a billion dollars to American investors with the British public footing the bill. Theatre School at 7.40 looks at how actors deal with insecurity as the drama students prepare for their first public performance. In the Red continues at 10 past 8 when the six volunteers decide on the best way to tackle the country's £50 billion deficit. Then at 8.30 the former supervisor of Hitler's personal train is among those sharing their memories of the railways at war. Clive Anderson's Notes and Queries is at 5 past 10, and the final decisive session of the UK Snooker Championship is at 10.40. Back to tonight, and that's about it for BBC Two. If you're staying up, Mark Tonderai's Late Night Music Party is on 1FM until 4, or a bit more relaxing, John Briggs is on Radio 2. But from me, Pauline Eyre, and all of the team here on BBC Two, have a peaceful night. We look forward to your company again tomorrow. Good night. <laughs>